Greetings. I am Dr. Shanta Smith, CEO and founder of Dr. Shanta Smith International. Welcome to the Essence of Education. The academic success of our students depends on how successful we are as the stakeholders that are responsible for providing our children with a quality education. If we take a look at what's going on in our school systems today, we see there are some things that are not conducive to the teaching and learning process. Specifically, if we take a look at the status dropout rate, in 2010, the National Center for Education Statistics reported that approximately 7.4% of our total student population had dropped out of school, which is not good. When we think about the quality of education we're providing for our students, we know that the population that is not being served, and specifically talking about those students that have dropped out, we know if they drop out of school, they are an uneducated citizen. And we know when individuals are uneducated, it creates problems for them in their future. So as stakeholders, and when we talk about stakeholders, we're talking about the home, the school, the community, and the church working together because each one of those entities has a direct impact on the life of the child. As a result of that, we need to make sure that all of us are on the same page. So as we look at the dropout rate, although the dropout rate has decreased over the years, those numbers are still dismal, which means that we together as a collective entity need to work together to do what's in the best interest of our children so that our children can be ready for the world of work and ready for a post-secondary education. It's imperative that we work together to move our system forward, to improve our system, to make sure that all of our children are receiving a quality education. Notice I said all of our children. We know that with public school systems across the country, there are public schools where kids are receiving quality education, and there are a number of children in public schools that are not receiving a quality education. So as stakeholders, again, we need to make sure that we're doing what's right, and what's right is making sure that each one of our children is academically successful so that they can have a successful life as adults. And when we think about success, Many of us think of many things. We might paint images in our heads about particular people. We might visualize different things happening. But at the end of the day, when we talk about success, we know that success means that we're meeting goals. And in order to meet those goals, we have to do something to accomplish those goals. So we have to have a plan and we have to be able to implement that plan in order to accomplish the plan. And so as stakeholders, the plan that we need to implement is a plan for academic success so that our children can be productive citizens that contribute to society in a positive manner. We can do this, America. Each stakeholder plays a role. It doesn't make a difference if you're a parent, if you're a community member, if you're a teacher, if you're a bus riser, if you're a businessman. It doesn't make a difference who you are. Your role is important to the children of the United States of America, to the children all over this world. So again, we need to make sure that if the system that our children is attending is not conducive to the teaching and learning process and our children are not experiencing academic success, then each stakeholder that plays a role in that child's life is responsible for doing something to make sure that that system becomes conducive to the teaching and learning process. Our children will not and cannot receive a quality education if the environment that they're in is not conducive to teaching and learning. So we need to make sure that every environment is conducive to teaching and learning so that all of our children can experience success and be productive citizens that contribute to society in a positive manner. Again, I'm Dr. Shanta